Hey, what's up guys? Camp and Russia here. Welcome back everybody to another Fortnite video and today I'm gonna update you guys on all the map changes like I've been doing recently. We're gonna talk about, uh, looks like a confirmation or a troll from Epic Games. We're gonna see, well, I'm gonna let you guys decide once I show you what they've tweeted. And then we're going to look at some other stuff that's a little bit more low-key, um, but that, that's been getting some attention and no one's really talked about. So, without further ado, let's get right into it. So, an update on the Rift. And keep in mind, I am filming this uh, at 2 a.m. Eastern, so about uh, four hours before uh, it's uploaded. Wait, six, no, seven hours before it's uploaded. There we go. Math, Braden, come on. First off, the uh, an update on the Rift, the portal, what's going down and the Durr Burger, of course, as we expected at Greasy Grove, has now been consumed. It's been taken down and there is now nothing left. But something that is weird is a new rift has spawned south of the large mountain between Greasy Grove and Snobby Shores, which is very, very random. It's no longer a location. We are now at a, this portal is now at a hill rather than a location. So I don't know what it's going to destroy. Is it going to take this whole mountain down next? I have no idea, but that's where we're at uh, for locations for, for rifts right now, locations of the rift, I should say. And then, of course, uh, like we've been doing, I show you a picture of the crack or the rift in the sky. And once again, it has gotten bigger. That that second expansion is almost bigger than the initial one there. The initial one's on the right, and the, uh, the initial expansion there is on the left. And it's getting bigger and bigger, baby. So we'll see where that goes. I feel like this weekend... There's going to be something to like we've been kind of having a pattern these last few days uh, and, and I'm not complaining. It's fun, man. It's exciting that they're doing something every single day, but I feel like they're going to switch it up a bit. Something new is going to come. And I got to be honest with you, when you're watching this video, I am, I'm driving off. I'm on a two day vacation. You'll have videos each day. So don't worry about that. But I will update you on on things that happen uh, uh, kind of today, I guess, Friday and Saturday. I'll update you all on that with a big video when I'm back on Sunday. So uh, hopefully uh, don't uh, don't don't go anywhere man i will be back i'm just uh i'm going to a little music festival i'm gonna enjoy myself for a couple days but again i will hit you with everything once i'm back i hopefully hopefully i don't miss too much all right so there's the crack now let's move on to something that's super low key that uh that's kind of it's interesting it's getting a lot of uh a lot of discussion a lot of talk about it it's got 900 votes on Reddit, this post I'm about to tell you. It's from Daniel F1404. Are we not going to talk about the mountain slowly getting more and more purple, especially the one with the shopping carts? He then links three screenshots, and I'm going to show you. I noticed this, actually, I should say my thumbnail designer, Mitch, noticed this right away. Right when the rocket launched, we noticed there was some purple as we were taking some screenshots for that abandoned house video, and... Apparently, it's getting more purple, more purple. I thought it was a visual glitch or something, but this has 900 upvotes. Usually with a glitch, people tend to point that out, but uh, it's I don't know what it means, man. I'll show you the screenshots right now. Boom, there's the first one. Uh, that's on the mountain. Is that right by Soccer Stadium, right north of Soccer Stadium? And then there is, uh, is, yeah, that's Soccer Stadium. And then here at my favorite spot, I just call it the spot, uh, down in that southeastern section of the map. And then, of course, we've got one here, uh, again, kind of the same thing. You can get kind of get a view from above. Uh, there's a lot of purple on that mountain to our to our right. And I don't, I'm getting kind of confused. That's the one beside Soccer Stadium, whatever you want to call that mountain, with the shopping cart ramps on them. There seems to be a lot of purple. So I don't know if that visualize or that means something, especially now that we're seeing that uh, that portal, that rift come up on a mountain randomly. Maybe some mountains are going to be taken away and corrupted. I couldn't tell you if you have any idea what like what this could mean, what it entails, the purple, the I'm going to call it corruption. Leave a comment down below and leave a comment with anything we talk about today or or your theory that you've you've maybe wrote a comment before. Update it, man, because I love reading them. And again, you guys give me as you've seen from yesterday's video. I listen to you guys a lot. You give me so many good ideas and I appreciate it. While you're down there touch that like button for me man it helps me out more than you think and join the rushers by subscribing to my channel i'd love to have you fortnite tweeted early uh early yesterday morning back from the depths the leviathan outfit returns available now and the picture is the leviathan outfit you know given the peace sign he's angry but the rift is in the background man and i here's the thing 
you guys know there that there was that big post and we're actually going to look over it again from a guy claiming that he had another friend at epic it's now been removed but other people have posted it and uh and it talked about a leviathan coming out and that you know and that's been a big theory a leviathan a massive leviathan that's what the monster is there was going to be this game mode and the leviathan was going to destroy tilted and moisty meyer that was a uh and still is what a lot of people think and epic knows this so i don't know if they're tweeting this to troll us because they obviously did not put the riff there by accident and back from the depths the leviathan outfit returns i don't know there is uh, so much speculation with this tweet it is either because Epic has trolled us in the past. Like, for example, uh, with the Meteor last season, everyone thought it was going to hit Tilted before that guy that's being sued leaked that it was going to hit du or, uh, Depot, D Depot, Dusty Depot. I forget the name of it now. It's been gone for a while. And, and what they did is they put all those signs and everything at Tilted saying tomorrow or today crossed out tomorrow and uh, just showing that we, you know, we, we had no idea what was going on. We were wrong. They trolled us. They've done it before. So that's what this could be. It could be a full on troll or that guy was correct and the Leviathan is the monster. This game mode's coming and, and he's, he's what we've been waiting for. But at this point... This is what we got uh, on this. Again, leave your comments down below because I want to know what you think about this. Do you believe it? Are they trolling us? Are they not? I should also point out the top comment, the top reply to the, the Reddit post talking about this picture is interesting. I also noticed how the Global Axe and Planetary Probe came back. I can see why the Probe, but the Global Axe is a completely different set. Maybe they're trying to say something through the item shop. So he's saying that the, the Globe Axe, which is not part of the set, the first time it came out, it came out with the Bright Gunner, I believe, um, is is saying something, right? Like a new, a new planet, a new world, because that theory kind of still exists. I should also point out that Jumping JJ said uh, when it was first released, yes, but the last time that the Leviathan was in the shop, it was the exact same set that we are seeing now. So this isn't the first time the Velo the Leviathan has came with the global axe. That was some speculation and, and maybe that was part of their plan, who knows, but I, I think it's just a coincidence. I really do, but I, I thought I'd point that out because uh, some people were speculating that. The so last thing we're gonna look at, I'm just going to remind you, I'm gonna bring up this, uh, this post because we've got, that's kind of all the new info. But if the Leviathan really is coming, and this is kind of the first real indication we've seen from Epic, it could be a troll, couldn't, could not be. Um, but if he was right about this, um, and he's been right about some other stuff, uh, we think, like the season five history themed, uh, the Flying Dutchman tier 100 skin, like that's still everyone's theory, and it's mostly based just off of this guy's post. And uh, he also said Tilted's going to be damaged. Moity, Moisty's going to be 80% destroyed by the Leviathan. And, like, he made all these massive claims. So if he's right about this, um, maybe he's right about some of this other stuff. I just kind of wanted to remind you, we're not going to go through the whole post again. Uh, but at the same time, he did make this claim as well. Omega versus Alpha or Charlie. They haven't decided a name yet is the Blockbuster skin. It's and and of course that seems wrong to me, right? We have uh, you know, he said that they hadn't decided a name, so maybe they chose Visitor in the end, but I don't know if I get an Alpha or Charlie vibe from that skin design, and I don't know if the Alpha Charlie would fit into the Visitor storyline at this point. We don't really officially know what that storyline is, but that part seems wrong to me which discredits this guy and uh and it surprises me that so many people still believe the leviathan theory because to me it seems this is the only proof and and he already got something wrong in his post um so i don't know i don't i i think i'm more on the side that lo that fortnite's trolling us i i gotta say but if you have an opinion or you have some random other piece of info to add to it, let me know in the comments down below. What do you think about this? Uh, I, I love reading them, man, and I appreciate it. So other than that, touch that like button if you're excited. And uh, I'm sorry if I miss anything. Again, uh, I will I will keep you up to date. I will update you as soon as, as, soon as I'm back. I'm going to wake up early Sunday morning, drive home. It's about a five-hour five hour drive home from where I'm going. And then uh, I'll be back and I'll be filming as soon as I'm home with, with everything. Because I assume some big things are going to happen this weekend. Uh, but I do have a big, massive video going out uh, for Saturday. So there'll still be uploads. There just won't be that current upload right when it happens. Uh, but stick around. I will keep you updated. And I can't, like, I, I'm back on Sunday, which I guess is the 8th. 
Is that the 8th? 8th or the 9th? And then we got a few days till season five and I will be on my computer like no other. And I will be, uh, again, keeping you updated. All right. I'm rambling. Thanks for watching guys. Uh, join the rushers by subscribing. If you're new around here, talk soon. Take care. Goodbye.